let's say that you want to take advantage of the new Pulse app and do nice graphics. If you edit any of the preset graphics, the part that might be kind of intimidating in here is this uh, select, you know, SQL-like type of, uh, you know, language, which you might not be familiar with. The rest is actually pretty easy, whether you want to make it a pie chart or, you know, any other type of primitive for nice graphics, they are all there. But the SQL or AQL, which is Arial Query Language for Curita, might be intimidating. So same thing with any one of the graphics that you may want to do. In a similar way, if you're writing a program that is going to communicate, look for some information in Curator or put some information in a reference set or whatever you want to do, uh, actually the samples for making that, uh, you can find it in here and they're very easy to follow. But again, all this needs to be done in SQL uh, and uh, AQL. Now, in 732, there is a new feature. I'm here in the log activity, the same thing exists for the network activity. And let's say that you you don't want to learn AQL yet, you just need to make the, the query that you want. So I have good news for you. If you go here and create a new search, let's say that the search that you want, and this is going to be just an example, uh, is going to be Let's say that uh, I'm not interested in the event name, log source is fine, event count, I don't care, start time, I don't care, category, I only want source and destination IP, the port I don't need, the username I don't need, and the magnitude I don't need. This, this are, these are the columns that I want in my particular search. And the parameter, let's say that I'm searching for uh, log source type, let's see that I'm searching for uh, BPC flow logs, Amazon BPC flow logs, and you add that, right? And the time frame uh, for the search, you can specify it here, see, well, I want this to be last uh, seven days, right? And this is very easy. You know how to do searches with this. No, no AQL involved here. So you perform your search. You test it out. That this is what I want. Um, and then let's say that you save it. Actually, I could have eliminated the first column as well. But let's say that you save it here. I'm going to call it uh, test uh, Amazon. Oops. I'm going to save it in my quick searches so I can see them easily. And I have that done, right? Now, if I go back to edit my search and I look for that search test Amazon and I load it, you probably have seen it already, but uh, you have this nice show AQL. When I click on it, notice that I get, I can even copy it to the clipboard, I get the SQL, the AQL version of that GUI search that I just did. And in fact, if I want to even try it further, I can actually paste it in here uh, and, and give it a go. And once I know that my search is precisely the one I want, I can just you know, grab it in here and put it in my program or put it in my polls uh, 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 graph. In fact, let's actually try that. I don't know what I'm going to get out of this, but uh, let's give it a go. So I instead of say instead of instead of this AQL statement, I'm going to put the one I put in the clipboard, and then you know, it's going to be a pie chart. Well, I don't have a username anymore. So let me actually run the query. And then, of course, uh, let's say that I want to put uh, source IP, for example, and in the Y axis, uh, log source. I'm making something up just to show the, the, the capabilities. So, and, I, and I save that search, and now I have, you know, 
that graph. I'm not showing anything relevant in here, but but, but you get the picture. Same thing for your uh, API calls. You have a, now a nice way that can postpone your learning on AQL. I will strongly recommend you to find the time to learn it. In fact, this is a great tool for actually learn it. You can actually go and perform your simple searches uh, in the basic, uh, uh, you know, doing the, the normal search, perform a search, and then see the AQL. So you begin to learn how the syntax works. This is not intimidating. This is uh, it's not as intimidating as it looks on the first time that you see it. Uh, and remember, this is also available for on the network activity as well.